experiment. The aim of this experiment is to determine the mass of the metal M0. Materials and apparatus. Metal. Prism. Wooden block. Mass of 50 grams. A piece of thread. Procedures. Number one. Place the metal provided on the edge of a prism. Balance the metal and record the value L or not. Fifty centimeters. Therefore, L naught is equal to fifty centimeters. Number two, and a fifty grams mass on the metal as shown below, such that X is equal to five centimeters. Move the metal until it balances. Record value of Y when the metal is balanced. Five centimeter mark. It is balanced at 36.5 cm mark. Therefore, Y is equal to 36.5 cm. Number 3. Move the 50 grams mass to a position where X is equal to 10 cm, 15 cm, 25 cm, 30 centimeters and 40 centimeters. Measure the corresponding values of Y for each value of X when the arrangement is balanced. Table of results. When X is 5 centimeters, Y is equal to 36.5 centimeters. When X is 10 centimeters, It is balanced at 38 centimeter mark. 38 centimeters when X is equal to 15 centimeters.
it is balanced at 39.5 cm mark. 39.5 cm. When x is equal to 25 centimeters. It is balanced at 42.5 cm mark. 42.5 cm. When x is 30 cm. It is balanced at 44 centimeter mark. 44 centimeters. When x is 40 centimeters. It is balanced at 47 centimeter mark. 47 centimeters. Plot a graph of y against x. A graph of y against x. Scale. Vertical scale. The highest number is 47. Using Twenty rooms. Forty seven divided by twenty is equal to two point three five. One centimeter represents two point three five centimeters. Horizontal scale. All data can be divided by five. Therefore, one centimeter represents five centimeters. Why in centimeters? X in centimeters. 
Thirty-five, forty. Thirty-five, forty. When y is equal to thirty-six point five, then x is five. Thirty-six point five to five. When y is equal to 38, then x is 10. 38 to 10. When y is 39.5, then x is 15. 39.5 to 15. When y is 42.5, then x is 25, 42.5 to 25. When y is 44, then x is 30, 44 to 30. When y is 47, then x is 40, 47 to 40. A graph of y against x. Determine the slope s of the graph. Point eight point five, comma thirty seven point six point thirty seven point five, comma thirty seven point six point thirty seven, comma five point five, comma forty six point three. Slope is equal to change in y over change in x which is equal to 46.3 minus 37.6 over 37.5 minus 8.5 which is equal to 8.7 over 29 which is equal to 0 0.3 therefore slope s is 0 0.3 calculate mass of the metal m naught using the ration s m naught over 50 plus s is equal to 1 solution S M naught over 50 plus S is equal to 1, whereby S is equal to slope, which is equal to 0 0.3. Then 0 0.3 M naught over 50 plus 0 0.3 is equal to 1. Then 0 0.3 M naught over 50 is equal to 1 minus 0 0.3. Then 0 0.3 m naught over 50 is equal to 0 0.7. Then 0 0.3 m naught is equal to 0 0.7 times 50. 0 0.3 m naught is equal to 35. Therefore, m naught is equal to 35 over 0 0.3, which is equal to 116. 0.66 which is repeating decimal which is approximately to 100
16.7. Therefore, mass of the metal M0 is 116.7 grams.